sanitation campaign is on, mm. we'll go to the La Labari Beach mm. or La Beach, as, as it's okay. called uh, by the indigents. And I, I am still amazed at the level of filth that people generate mm. and don't seem to care about whether or not it's affecting society negatively or positively. Mm. I am amazed because they talk about education, they talk about sensitization, mm. they talk about you know provision of resources to help clean. It's all going down. So clearly there's an issue with enforcement. Mm -hmm. The enforcers are not there. I mean, how, how many times have we been told by this government, for example, that we're going to have sanitation marshals? Where are they? Mm. We yeah, were, they did say in July. They said this month. Well, they were but going you see, to, you know, we were all put in a room at the banquet hall mm. when Mr. Kofiada was minister for sanitation and water resources, and they mentioned that right when we left that meeting, we we're going to have the sanitation marshals. Nobody has explained why. After that big declaration, we don't have them. Don't have them. And suddenly, we are being given a new date without a, another explanation. Mm. Mm. Pretty much the same way we're saying we have dropped the chamber, but nobody is telling us how much we spent and who ordered for the money to be spent mm. for the architectural designs to be well, done. Or would not spend a peso on it. Exactly. Mm. Nobody is explaining anything. So, mm. enforcement is key. And some older people have been calling for a retrospection and asking that we go back to the town council or right. town council days right. or what they, what they call it. Jo is that what we need? Johnny, it, I mean, it, 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 it will be part of the solution. But look, from where I sit, and yesterday I was listening to a guy, and I think what he said is very, very prominent. Look, mm. the only way out of this mess is that we need to um, put into our educational structure the system we go through. Right. I mean, e sanitation uh, pointers. Mm. Okay. So that right from the kindergarten through the primary to the junior high school, we have kids being told how not to litter, mm. how to dispose of uh, 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 refuse mm. and all that. So it's instilled for me, in us from, yes, from the, the beginning. For mm. me, the, the problem is that, like Johnny said, we, we, we do it with careless abandonment. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We don't care. We don't mm -hmm. care. Because it is not imbibed in us mm. yes, okay yes. so the only way out is to start from the kindergarten level right as all this talk about we're going to make ghana clean in the next four years mm. without starting from that level the root. for me mm. it's a waste Nothing of of, of 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 uh, uh resources a waste of our time let us go back start from the kg so mm. that the kids who will come up will know that you don't need to drop later mm. you dispose and dispose well right mm. that is the only way out mm. for now we can we can manage the situation mm. but if you want a, a holistic approach that's where we should start from true i i agree so, that's i agree I agree. Also, mm. um, aside, you know, the enforcement that we're all mm. always talking mm. about, us as individuals have to do what is right. Mm. We've well, said this severally, mm. you know, you cannot throw rubbish where you're not supposed mm. to. There are no bins in mm. the public transport. Well, I, I've seen and we've a, spoken a, a about few it. bins mm. in town these days, but I agree with you on right. right. the public yeah, transport. So because because yeah, there are none, you throw it in there, you no, know you what see, you're supposed to do. The other time, uh, we're going to Big Bay, sir. Mm. Myself, uh, um, Tano with, with the driver, Miss, right. Miss, and then an elderly woman. This this should be after after fifty five, fifty six, mm. getting into sixty. She just bought pure water or mineral water, sachet water. Mm. She finished drinking right by where the Shiraj Ioko office is on that major pavement. She dropped it, and she then she dropped it. it. Yeah. So then we walked up to her and said, "Madam, please pick it, please pick it up." She said, "Oh, I'm Bepra," and then we said, "No, please pick it up." This was around. Two, no, 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 before 2 p.m. In broad daylight. In broad the daylight. Afternoon. There's an elderly woman mm. who has grandchildren, perhaps, who has children, who many will consider as an adult or right-thinking, you know, member of society. She finished the period and she just squashed it and put and, and put Johnny, it on the floor. Johnny, she's not alone. There's so many others. She put it on the floor. So you see, out there. we do not have the resources to put people on the streets, mm. by the roadside, to check persons who, who do this. Right. So the only way out is that enforcement 
we can try it. Yes. For instance, look yes. at your door. There are several times that the AMA has mm. tried to put gas there to stop people from right. uh, defecating mm. in it. But as soon as the guys uh, are off, they go, they go, they back. go back. So we don't have the resources to keep this In fact, there was an elder, another elderly mm. man mm. over 60 years mm. near the door who was, was defecating in the afternoon. Mm. A certain choke or someone confronted him mm. and he slapped him yeah, smashed his phone up, yeah. Yeah. and the police have yeah. not done anything yeah. about it yeah. even though the case was before. reported yeah. so it, it's 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 painful mm. that we continue to have some of the it's, it's so painful i feel so sad Stop, so let, very, let's very sad. We, I, like i said we we will the enforcement will be there but we need to go back and take a look at the, the you basics. know last mm. sunday mm. last sunday i had a, i had a small sitting at home and I've been talking about having a sanitation plan as part of it. Right. I provided rubbish bins advantage yes, points. Yes, you did. People dropped their refuse in it. But there were also some people, some that of my friends, <laughs> who had gone to school, who who were who I thought were enlightened, <laughs> who to still do dropped anyhow. the thing on the floor. <laughs> on the floor. And I confronted I said, look, <laughs> can't you see the rubbish bin? <laughs> drop it inside. It's How so difficult simple. is that? But Just so, pick so, it up, so drop we, it in the so, bin. So we are over proud. Oh, no. Uh, come on, please. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, you make use of your education. Right. Let people okay. feel that you have been educated. So those who are not educated, come from Then they can learn from I you. I can't believe Join it. the hashtag garbage out and help us to get across other parts of uh, Ghana clean. Uh, the state or the government might be engaged in some effort. But certainly, without... Uh, uh, the citizens, we will not get anywhere.